Randall Park deserves the world. <laughs> I think we should give him an award on this stage right now. Just yeah. The yeah. But best directorial debut award. Absolutely. Mm, Honestly. Thank you. Shortcomings, <laughs> based on a graphic novel by Adrian Tomina, is about uh, three Bay Area urbanites. <laughs> Uh, uh, living life, making mistakes, mm. Mm. trying to grow from those mistakes. Ooh. I was thinking about like directing uh, eventually and, and writing things that maybe I could direct in the future. But then I, I found out that this script based on this book that I had loved for so long was uh, looking for directors. Uh, and I was like, oh, I got to throw my hat in the ring. I guess in that sense, it, it kind of fell in my lap, but I had to pitch myself as a, a first time director. And, and thankfully, uh, it all worked out. So Randall Park, <laughs> one of his origins was the MTV show Wild and Out. Yeah. He was in the first two, three seasons. Yes, yes. Iconic, Iconic. show of my upbringing. So I, Audition in 2017 to be a cast member. I didn't get it. I was devastated. Cut to 2022. They asked me to be a celebrity team captain. And I was shook. I was like, oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Like, I have to tell Randall. So I emailed Randall. I, I, I listed. I said, one, congrats on shortcomings. Can't wait to see it. Two, I got, I'm going to be on Wild and Out. <laughs> and, you know, full circle, blah, blah, blah. So then he replies, who, who this? <laughs> <laughs> I, you know? I do, yeah, because it was the same thing with Hugh Ho, which is your producing partner, and I've been friends with Hugh for over 10 years. And when this came out, he was like, Ali, I have to talk to you about a movie that we're making. And I think one of the things that you're touching on is that it can actually happen for us that we would actually be able to work with our friends and our community. Because I think 10 years ago, that wasn't the case. It was like a, this pipe dream where we're like, mm -hmm. oh, maybe one day we could all work together. And that's like, ah, ha, sure, sure. But I think now it's it's actually becoming a reality. And the things that Randall and Hugh are making and the things they have on their slate, are, are just, it's, it's groundbreaking. And for mm -hmm. us to be able to be friends and work together is mm -hmm. amazing. Mm -hmm. The dream. The ability, the, the opportunity to have a character like this in a movie and to be able to have an actor like Justin play such a complex, mm -hmm. difficult character, but to bring so much, uh, so many levels and so so much, uh, I don't know, sadness mm. and, and anger okay. and good intentions, but you know, uh, along with every character uh, in the cast, to be able to present these characters to the world, I think was just such a, so exciting. Yeah. yeah. And I yeah. think there's something too. I, so I, I moved here to LA when I was 14 and I started acting. And I remember back then it was this whole thing of if there was an Asian character, it was almost like you could only be a trait of a character. Mm. Like you're a girl who likes math or you do Kung Fu. I mean, there was just mm -hmm. so much of that or you have an accent. Right. And I think what's cool and just so groundbreaking is we have these breakdowns of these characters that come from a, a graphic novel as well. So you have a whole amazing backstory to pull from that has all of the highs and the lows and the growth and the change and, mm. and, and the flaws. Yeah. I mean, hence the shortcomings that I think is, is amazing for us to be able to play and dabble in. 